The reason I chose Wright State was because when I was looking for a residency program, I was looking for some place that would be my new family, and that's exactly what I found here at Wright State. From our amazing faculty to our uh, easy to reach attendings to our senior residents and chief residents, who are always so supportive and patient with us, to my co-residents who have always been so supportive, um, everyone here at Wright State is here to help you succeed. Since I went to medical school here, I did have kind of an inside track into what the program was all about, which definitely factored into my decision to rank it at the top of my rank list uh, at the end of my uh, fourth year. So the things that I really that stood out to me during my time in medical school here were um, primarily the people here and just seeing the residents, the way they interacted with each other. They really seemed to be happy, to be enjoying the work that they were doing, and they were just very supportive of one another. Um, so seeing, I knew that that was the kind of environment that I wanted to complete my training in. Uh, so that's definitely one of the big reasons why I chose to come to uh, Wright State for my internal medicine training. I would also say that aside from just the residents themselves, uh, the, all the attendings were very approachable, uh, definitely set a lot of side, a lot of time to do a good education, uh, but still um, not taking up too much of the time so the residents were still able to get their work done on time and get out, but still really um, getting the high yield information that they needed. So another thing I like about the program, um, I think the staff did a very good job of selecting the chief residents of our program this year and every year also. I actually did a away rotation uh, the year before coming here and I got along well with the chiefs that year also. But I think our chief residents have been very helpful this year from day one, um, just making us feel welcome and kind of knowing what we're uncomfortable about and kind of helping us with that. Um, there's been a few times they've kind of answered questions before I could even ask them because they already knew. Um, so yeah, I really, um, that's something else I really like about this program. I think we do a great job of choosing chief residents to help the interns kind of get rolling. So one of my favorite parts about being here in residency um, has been the relationships that I've formed. Um, and um, that extends from your co-residents to your seniors to um, the uh, faculty um, that you interact with. I recently actually just got married um, and I had residents there at my wedding. They even came to my home for some of our pre-wedding events. I had faculty there at my wedding as well. Um, and that just, I think, goes through how close I became with all the people around me. And I'll certainly be in uh, contact with them moving forward. It's really great to see when your friends are having kids and um, you watch them through such an important phase of our lives and you're there for them um, through every step of the way and moving forward, it's gonna be exactly the same even when we're not in residency anymore. Um, so it's been really amazing. Um, I was worried coming out of med school um, that I wouldn't have the same group of friends I did and I actually feel like I have an even stronger group of friends being here because we're all kind of getting through things together. So I also really enjoy all the people we're around. I think we have really great co-residents. Um, uh, people are from all over. Um, it's diverse in the sense that 12 of our residents come from the Air Force uh, side and the other half come from the civilian side. So you really get to know um, people from all over the U.S. Um, and who have different training experiences than you do coming in. Um, and that's been one of my favorite parts um, about living here um, and working here. One of the biggest things for me, both in choosing it and loving it here, has been the people. I know a lot of different programs say that, but um, my wife and I just had our first kid and the amount of support that we've gotten from the program, both leadership um, and my colleagues, has been through the roof. So the people are always wonderful. They're down um, to hang out. They're down to help whenever you need, both medically and outside of the hospital. Um, one of the other things that I really like that the program does is any kind of idea that you have, um, once you spin it to the leadership, they will work tirelessly to um, help get that off the ground in some way, shape, or form. We've had residents make um, new curriculums um, for ultrasound courses. We've had people come up with different classes and things like that, new electives, um, or just you know general wellness. So I really enjoy the way that they do that. So I wanted to just talk a little bit about the relationship within the residents uh, and also the relationship between the resident team and the nursing staff as well. Um, so within the residence, there's always somebody in your team or in the team working with you in the same room. There's always somebody there to run things by if you're in question or if you have any doubts. Um, even when they're not physically there, there's always somebody that you can reach via like text, text or phone. Um, so in a way, it gives security to have people behind you, chief residents attending that are always approachable and very friendly when you run things by them. 
So I think that's one thing that I really enjoy. In terms of the relationship with the nursing staff, um, it's especially at the sites such as VA and base. Um, it's, given that it's a smaller facility, uh, it's very easy to just go up to them physically and communicate and make sure nothing gets lost in, in the process. So it's I like that about that. Here at the downtown hospital of the Valley, there's you, given that we use Epic, everybody is very easily reachable through secure messaging. So at the end, there's always somebody there and if you want to reach somebody, it's very easy and um, a quick process to communicate with everybody. One of the reasons why I chose to attend Wright State University and for me being a, a military resident with Wright-Patterson Air Force Base was the people here are so very kind and they were so hard, uh, welcoming and so great to work with and very patient with the learning curve and trying to adjust to residency life from graduating medical school. The wonderful people and you know from the the senior residents to the chiefs to the attendings to the consultants and the and the specialists here, everyone here is just so very nice and welcoming and patient. And I think that is one of the nice things is it's not scary to go and consult cardiology. They're actually very nice and they are very welcoming and will help you with anything. And I think that goes for all, all the specialists as well. I think there's, there really is a culture here where we're all on the same team and we're here to help patients. So many times at residents will volunteer to just be like, hey, like, let me do this for you because you're swamped right now and, and I can help you out. Um, and I've always felt that my co residents have my back when it comes to clinical work and things like that. And we also hang out all the time outside the hospital, of course. Um, but, but when we are here, I, we work as a great team, and, and I never feel like I have to ask for help because they're always offering it. Yeah, I would say uh, one of the biggest strengths uh, of our program is the culture of our residency. Um, and the, we have a collegial environment, and everyone is pushing to be their best, and that's a great place to be in especially during this long haul of residency um, to continue to strive to be the best that we can be as physicians and physician learners. Uh, as a residency, we all know that we have obligations outside of medicine, uh, whether it be celebrating uh, with friends for their wedding uh, or um, having a new baby. Um, you know, our residents are flexible to change uh, schedules with one another um, if possible and that makes for uh, such a better residency experience for everybody and um, there's not much else I could ask in a program.